Hello friends, Christian here with Brick Life Crisis. This channel is recommended for adult and teen fans of LEGO. If you are younger than the age of 13, you're welcome to watch, but first, get your parents' permission. Hello friends, Christian here with Brick Life Crisis again. Today we're taking a look at a LEGO City Poly Bag. This is set number 30570. This is Wildlife Rescue Hovercraft, consisting of 35 pieces, including one minifigure. It's recommended for ages 5 and up, and without any further ado, let's go ahead and open it up, build it up, and see what we think. As for extra parts, all we have is this one by one trans blue plate and the small low friction Technic pin. And here it is, the Wildlife Rescue Hovercraft. As you can see, we have the hovercraft, the pilot, and a monkey. Let's go ahead and take a look at each component one by one. All right, first up we have the monkey. This guy is great. Uh, we saw him recently in the um, Rescue ATV set. There were a couple of them in that set. This is just the one, but uh, he's done really well. Uh, he's got kind of a curl in his tail so he can hang from a tree branch. He has a bar-sized grip in his hand so he can hold fruit or other bar-sized accessories. He's got a cute print on his face. And uh, overall, really well done. It's a dual-molded character, so um, the lighter tone on the face and the ears is actually dual-molded into the monkey, which is kind of nice. It's not going to fade away. Um, the eyes could, I suppose, but the uh, the face and the ears are molded in that color, so pretty neat. And here's our pilot. He's got a blue vest on and some cargo pants, a red ball cap, smile on his face. No alternate face, of course, because you'd see it on the backside, but on the back of his vest you can see it says Rescue with the, uh, the Animal Rescue logo above it. Um, nicely done figure, and uh, the the whole theme of the Animal Rescue is kind of fun if you are... Um, into zoology and that sort of thing, you can have a whole adventure set where you're, uh, you know, rescuing animals and putting them in your wildlife rehabilitation center or zoo or what have you. Um, but uh, yeah, pretty good figure. And this is our hovercraft. It is small. Um, it carries this little crate, which has an apple, which is uh, maybe a treat to coax the monkey into coming close so that the rescuer can um, get a hold of them. There are some suggestions of lights up front with those trans blue one by one plates. Uh, we have the printed uh, animal rescue logo on the front. Um, as you can see, there's just room for one figure in there, some handlebars. We've got the uh, propulsion uh, propeller on the back, and the suggestion of some floating, uh, you know, I don't know what you call those things, pontoons or whatever to let it stay above the water. Um, this does not actually float, just to be aware of that, and it does not actually hover, of course, but the idea is that this would skim above the water or some relatively flat land. Um, so anyway, kind of a cool little craft, and uh, yeah, happy to have that. And here we have the craft coming straight at us with the monkey and the crate with the apple in tow, and uh, they're on their way back to the rescue headquarters. Here we go. So as a poly bag, this set retails for $5 here in the US. I picked this up at my local Walmart and uh, not a bad deal. It's a relatively inexpensive way to get the monkey. The figure is not too bad and the build is okay as well. So anyway, that about does it for this one. This has been Christian with Brick Life Crisis. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave us a like. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave those below. And as always, thanks so much for watching. Until next time, take care. Bye for now.